Hello everybody, it's your boy BraceBits01, welcome back to another video, and yes, this is a continuation from part 1 to part 2 for Wrestlemania 38 for the Build-A-Figure, Vince McMahon, so, uh, you know, you guys know the drill, 1, this video will not have a thumbnail, 2, I already had this talk about it with YouTube and a little bit with my audience, uh, just wanted to keep things simple uh i wasn't arguing with the fans about it i was arguing with youtube just wanted to put that disclaimer really quick because usually i blame pretty much everything on youtube but hey i still take responsibilities no hard feelings no hard feelings for youtube i mean they make mistakes sometimes they'll make mistakes sometimes i wish they would admit it but you know it is what it is three please support this channel and enjoy the video so uh yeah Please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and uh, share this video with your friends, and uh, yeah, uh, let's jump into this review with the phenomenal one, AJ Styles. Let's do this. Enjoy the video. Thank you. Whoa, whoa, it's Wrestlemania. Alright guys, I know Wrestlemania is over, and even though we're in the month of April slash, you know, Wrestlemania season, but also March is also the Wrestlemania season too. So Wrestlemania has two seasons, one in March, one in May, and that's about it. So uh, we're going to be opening up the phenomenal AJ Styles. I mean, come on man, we love this dude right here. From Gangsville, Georgia. Well, actually, he's from North Carolina. But, hey, you know what? Gangsville, Georgia, you guys are all right. You know that? And if you guys want to read and pause about him, how he fought The Undertaker at WrestleMania 36, you are glad, gladly welcome to. So go right on ahead and read it in 3, 2, 1. We're about to move on right after I'm done shaking the, right after I'm done shaking the camera. My apologies. Anyways, you got to get all of these four amazing wrestlers. We already reviewed it all. Stone Cold Steve Austin. How about a couple beers, what? How about a couple beers, what? Give me a hell yeah, hell yeah. Ah, oh, Stone Goes Steve Austin. He's a, he's, a, he's a riot. And then you get Shawn Michaels. And then you have Brett the Hitman Hart from Old Canada. And then you have to collect basically a few body parts from Vince McMahon. You have to get his chest, his arms, his head, and legs. So today we're going to be doing his chest. So without further ado, guys, after we're done taking a good 360 out of this amazing box right here, True FX Edition, by the way, which is absolutely, 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 once again, amazing. Without further ado, let's open up the phenomenal one, AJ Styles. Let's do this. Here he is, ladies and gentlemen. Give it up for the main man himself, the phenomenal one. There he is, AJ Styles. He comes with a shovel and one interchangeable hands. But however, he comes with the best part of this figure, the merchandise. I mean, come on, man. You gotta have the merchandise for the phenomenal one. Of course, he is wearing the original club, which means Bullet Club for short for WWE. But hey, still a classic phenomenal t-shirt. And, uh, he, oh, this one's new. If you look very closely... It has the OG little, um, you know the thing that John Cena wears on his shoulder? So he's basically wearing it on his, on his wrist. So he's wearing it on his wrist. Of course, he comes with, yours truly, a shovel. What do you use this shovel for? I don't know. Maybe digging for finding treasure? Or, I don't know, maybe hit someone in the face with it? Actually, you don't want to hit somebody in the face with it because... That could cost someone a real good, good, real good concussion. You don't want this how it, you don't want this how it goes. You don't want this dead, right? Well, you're dead wrong. <laughs> Just kidding. Anyways, here's AJ Styles and all of his glory. So let's review this guy, shall we? Let's do this. Alrighty, so here we go with the phenomenal AJ Styles. So let's get into this, right? So of course we gotta. Open his arms wide like he's about to do his 
classic phenomenal pose because he's phenomenal. So this is so here it is right here. All right, so let's go ahead and move the arms real quick. Give it a good old twisty twist. There you go, twisting it pretty good because it's supposed to twist because that's what every action figure arm's supposed to do. You got to give it a good old nice a a nice a twisty, nice twist a rooney. You just keep on twisting it right over here. And then he has double jointed elbows, which is pretty nice. So he can like drop an elbow on somebody when it's a, a Black Friday. Do you know what I'm talking about? You've seen it. Come on. You guys seen a couple of Ben and Jacob Le Lego episodes. I always love to make fun of Black Friday. It's always about the dropping elbows on Black Friday. Because you want to know why? Someone's going down. Exactly. And no, I haven't been involved with the Black Friday or anything. I don't associate with the... Black Friday stores at Walmart or Target or something like that. But if I do, gonna drop an elbow. Gonna drop an elbow on them, baby. With a Diet Coke in my hand. I don't have a Diet Coke in my hand, but I will get a Diet Coke soon. But I'm not thirsty right now. I'm good. And of course, he comes with the phenomenal one right here on his, yours truly, his elbow. Because he likes to, like, mess with it a little bit. Because he likes to protect his elbow. But anyways, you get his... Phenomenal gloves. We'll get to the interchangeable hands in a minute. So his legs split pretty good with his nice blue jeans. They're definitely you know, they're kind of like aqua color. Do you guys agree? So he can definitely kick pretty well, but he does not kick back because of the butt area. So, or should I say, the butt talks. And then he can run with his left knee, right knee. He can bend both of them. He can do a a, a fifty splash. Or, or, or pull off an Eddie Guerrero. I mean, the frog splash. The, the possibilities are endless. And then, of course, you get the old classic Elite 73 or 4, if I believe so, head scan of AJ Styles. Hopefully, we'll get a new AJ Styles head sculpt. Maybe we'll get, a, like, an angry version or a confused one or a laughing one. I would like to have a laughing AJ Styles face for this action figure just because it will make things a little bit different. And then you have some ankle pivots, good old ankle pivots, and then um, I think you can, yeah, you can definitely bend the foots, all that good stuff. Does the head go 60 degrees? Yes, it does, I think. Well, actually, I have to take off the shirt first. So, of course, the best part of having an action figure, you have a cloth t-shirt, and it comes off, look at that. Is that beautiful? It's, it's amazing. I like t-shirts slash non-t-shirts come off easily. On a phenomenal AJ Styles figure or a woman's figure. It don't matter, man. What matters is if it comes off, it's worth it. So this is what he looks like. Shirtless. His manly body, of course. Of course, he still has the classic Daniel Bryan torso, as usual. And, of course, he has the years for his children. So, uh, pretty interesting. Very interesting indeed. So, yeah. There you go. So that's what he looks like, shirtless, looking all manly and strong. And uh, this also spins, in case we end off the video too soon. Hopefully don't. We'll get to the perfect ending, don't you worry. All of these spin, the left and right legs spin, so that's pretty good. And now let's try the head one more time. I know his hair is a little bit long, but there you go. His head can spin 60 degrees, but definitely not in real life because that is very hard. Very hard indeed. Everybody, it's time. Alright, alright, relax people, relax. We're going to get to the interchangeable hands. So how do you do it, you may ask? Watch and learn, kiddos and fellow teenagers who like to collect action figures, including myself. It's all good. Take your action figure, hold it with this, hold it with your left hand, and then you pull on your right hand. One, two, three, and a half. Boom. Just like that. That was pretty phenomenal. You take this hand right here, right? And you take the good old right hand, and then you push it with all your might with both fingers and both hands. And there you go. He's saying, hi guys, I'm AJ Styles. But we ain't done yet. We gotta do the exact same thing. So one more time if you guys weren't looking. Boom. Just like that. It doesn't break... It doesn't break this part, it stays on. It, it can stay on or stay off, so it doesn't ruin the figure itself. 
Boom. There we go. Are you guys ready for this? I know you guys are ready for this. Get ready to fly. You are, you are. I am, I am. I know that's a TNA reference. I know. I know. It's a good old TNA reference. All right. Impact Wrestling. I know. Shout out to you guys. But anyways, he could do this. That is so cool. I don't know why we could have had double jointed elbows in the first place. Like AJ Styles can pull this off. I hope we get another one with double jointed elbows. Maybe he can bring back the um the classic one here. I'll show you which classic one I'm talking about. It's like my all time favorite AJ Styles figure. Here he is, ladies and gentlemen, my favorite elite action figure of the phenomenal one of AJ Styles. This was my first AJ, a AJ Styles, by the way, before I got this one. So um. Yeah, here he is, the Elite Series 74, 76, I believe, somewhere between in the 40s, the phenomenal AJ Styles. This is his blue attire when he showed up at the 2016 slash 2015, no, I'm probably sure it was 2016, when AJ Styles made his phenomenal debut at the WWE's pay-per-view, the Royal Rumble. However, he hasn't won it, but he had great matches with Chris Jericho and all those good other wrestlers, and yeah. So I like this figure, so I kind of wish this one had double-jointed elbows so he can do what he's doing right here, right now. So, uh, yeah. Anyways, guys, I'm going to put him next to him because they just look cool together. Like, look at that. Boom, boom. It's just fantastic. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching this amazing video. If you guys enjoyed, why not hit that like button? It really supports the video. You just click that like button, and you're good to go. Or, if you're really liking into my channel... Why not just hit that good old classic subscribe button? Click it. It takes like about two to three seconds. Just click that subscribe button. Same thing for the notifications. About two to three seconds. You click on it. And then boom. You are part of the family. You are part of the Bryce Pitt 01 family. Because we do this type of videos. We do Lego videos. We do all kinds of things on this amazing channel. Stay tuned. The best is yet to come. I'll see you guys next time. You guys rock. Peace out. Now wait just a second. You thought this video was going to come to an end? Pfft. Never judge a book by its cover, my friend. I know that's a cliche TikTok thing. I know TikTok's cringe. I don't blame you. But since I have the chest and the head, here it is. Let's do it. Let me do this off camera so I know what I'm doing. There he is, you guys. We got Vince McMahon, baby. Now we just need the arms and the legs, and we'll get there. Now this video is over. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.